Hey everyone, welcome back to Cooking with Shotgun Red and I'm Sheila. I'm Jennifer and if you're joining us for the first time, welcome and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. And ring the bell. And thanks to all our regular subs for coming back every time we put out a new recipe. We so appreciate you. And if you like biscuits, taters, and ham, you're gonna love this recipe. Exactly. This is a super easy recipe to whip up together and put in the oven and it feeds mm. a lot. It's just delicious. You're gonna love it so we're gonna take you back and show you how it's done. We're starting out with a just a large bowl here, and I got all my stuff ready to go. And we're using two cans of cream of chicken soup. I'm just gonna get that First out of First can, there. yeah, look at that. Gotta have cream of chicken soup. That goes with anything. It a does. can of cream of something. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Never underestimate a woman with a can of cream or something. Right, exactly. <laughs> and today is chicken soup. Exactly. I guess you could probably use mu the mushroom. Yeah, that would work. Half a quarter cup of milk. And stir that in evenly. And I'm going to save the rest of that for a little bit because I'm going to need it here. And one teaspoon each of garlic powder and onion powder. And mix that up with your finger. Yeah, you're not going to need salt in this because the ham provides plenty of salt. So, and some black pepper. And that's one teaspoon. So we'll mix that in. Get it combined here. Oh, yeah. Whip that up. Whip it together here. Mm hmm. And then some diced ham and two cups of diced ham to be exact. We'll add that in. And if you don't have ham, you can use turkey or anyway. chicken. Yeah, either one. Either one works. We'll just mix that together. Today just happens to be ham. That's right, because we have extra ham left. A lot of ham left in the fridge, so I want to use it up. And two cups of shredded cheddar cheese. I love cheese. Who doesn't love cheese? Mm. I love cheese. I do too. Awesome. Makes everything good. That and butter. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Those are the two best, two best ingredients ever. Yes. Oh. Mix that together. Mm. And then. Oh, mixed veggies, corn, peas, and carrots. Yeah, I picked out the green beans because I'm going to use them for something else. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm just using, you know, thawed out. We actually warm these up in the microwave a little bit. You definitely want to make sure that all this is thawed and warmed up a little bit before you put it in here because it's, it's not going to be in there long enough to cook thoroughly if you don't. So definitely make sure it's completely thawed and even warm it up a little bit in the microwave before you mix it together. That's really going to help. And mix that. Oh, that's good. Then, and then we're adding the remainder of the milk. And that just cut, because it, it starts to get thick and it's just easier. So I like to like save a little bit and do it, you know, after and help me mix it together. Mm. Once we get that completely combined. We have a pre-greased 9 by 13 bacon dish. And we're going to add our potatoes in. This is a frozen bag of O'Brien's, and I like to use the O'Brien because it's got the peppers already in it and onion and stuff, so it's it's kind of nice to have a little bit of the in ingredients already in there. Yeah, it adds a lot of flavor, and th this is already defrosted, and we heated this up in the microwave also, so it's almost cooked, so it's just going to basically be crisping up underneath this. And now we add our good stuff. Start scooping it on top of the taters. And this is such a thick, mm, you know, like casserole that. dish. So you, you, you definitely want to make sure all that stuff is, you know, heated up and not frozen at all because it won't cook completely if it is. You don't want to feel like you bit down on a rock or anything. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that wouldn't be good at all. No. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> there goes one of my tooth. Yeah. It's smooth, it's smooth. Mm -hmm. 
No, here's the biscuits. The whopping kind. That's right. And this is the Southern Homestyle Biscuits. And... Yeah, Steve liked to call them whomping because he always whomped them on the side of the counter. Oh, yeah. Whomp biscuits. Yeah. Now you cut them into quarters. Yeah. That's like a perfect size for this. So we'll do all these just like that. Then... Now we're going to place them evenly on the casserole. And this is the perfect amount for this dish. You can just kind of place them around and wherever. It doesn't have to be pretty. <laughs> just, just wherever you can fit them. <laughs> leave, a little, leave a little space in between so when you're scooping it out later, it, you know, you can get your gonna, spoon in there. Yeah, they're going to swell up a little bit. That's right. And this could swell right up on you. They do. <laughs> Trust me, they do. <laughs> it's like me making sugar cookies. That stuff just swells right up. The whole thing just disappears. <laughs> Whatever shape it was supposed to be. <laughs> Look at that. Mm, we have preheated the oven to 350 degrees. And we're going to put them in there for about 20 to 25 minutes and check them. And I'm going to turn that down to 325 because I don't want it to burn on top. So let them sit in there for another 15 and then, and then we'll see how it comes out. Ooh, look at that. Yeah. Now we need to brush on some of this butter. That's right, because everything's better with butter. And it's yummy. Look how shiny. Doesn't look, don't, don't biscuits look pretty with butter on them? It does. I mean, just so appetizing. You just want to like, just dig right in. <laughs> yeah, hands and all. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Everything is better with butter. That's right. So we'll just base that on every one of these little biscuits. And doesn't that look good? Mm. And if you had a house full of people or or just want to make up something for the week that you can eat on all week. This is perfect. And you can freeze this. Yeah, absolutely. Look at that. I think mm. we should just dish some of this up. What I do you think? I think so. All right. right. And this one's mine. I know. You like them corners. Oh, I do. I always like the first part. <laughs> give me them corners. Yes, give me the corners. Yum, yum. Mm. Delicious. Look at that. All that flavor in there. Yes. You can just keep dishing if you want to. <laughs> <laughs> just keep scooping some oh, yeah. on there Bring for it you. on. Bring it on. <laughs> Let's try it. <laughs> Two forks up. Look at this. Yes. Doesn't that look delicious? Them taters. Yes. And Biscuits. Mm-hmm. Mm that that is has good. like so much flavor in it. It is so good. You guys are going to love this. And it's so easy. It kind of so reminds me of like a little bit of a... Um, pot pie? A little bit. Yeah. Yeah. But it's 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 just got its own like unique flavor mm -hmm. with that, doesn't it? Well, we know you're gonna love this. You gotta give this recipe a try, because we certainly do. And as Steve would say, is this the best biscuit tater and ham bake you've ever tried? If, if it ain't, ain't it, it ought, ought to be. be. We'll see you next time right here on Cooking with Shotgun Red. Bye. Bye. All right, let's see. Um mm. 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 oh, so good. Mom, good, good. You really good. gotta try this. This mm. is really good. Mm. Well, that's Shishi and Jen Jen, them two girls having too much fun. We hope you enjoy this recipe, and we really hope you subscribe to our channel. That's easy. Little Shotgun Red's face will pop up over here in a little bit. When you click on it, it'll say subscribe, and then you're subscribed. Next to it will be a little notification bell. If you click that little bell, then YouTube will send you every single one of our recipes or a notification that we posted one as soon as it comes out. See you next time right here on Cooking with Shotgun Red. Is this the best? If it ain't, it ought to be.